I can't apparently gift subs to my own channel right now. Which is really weird. Could call it an iron tax. Uh, I've tried to pay that myself because the goal is to... The goal is to make it feel painful, kind of. Anyway. Oh well. I'll deal with it. I don't know why I can't do this. I tried this yesterday, right? We had two banked iron cha iron uh, iron taxes. All right. Maybe we can mentally deal with that. I don't want to end the run for that, particularly. I don't really want to fight this girl either. Fucking hate hexes. Thank you, Alphanese. Kill an archer. Could ignore the fight. I mean, we could take the fight and win it. Just back line again, right? So, very similar to what we did, just slightly different. It's frustrating. Frustrating to kill the hex on round one and then die to the wolves. Not happy about that. Not happy about that at all. Yeah. yeah, I'm not setting up to fight exactly what there. It doesn't really matter what exactly was there. Quitters never win. Thanks, uh, Vader's Jester. I don't know why I can't donate to my own channel. I was able to do this previously. Now it just gives me an error. It was doing it to me yesterday when I was trying to gift subs as well. Credit card information is accurate and correct. Like, up to date and correct. Why the fuck isn't it letting me do it? A new Thank you Triple P and Daniel for the gifted sub. Or, well, Daniel for the sub and Triple P for the gifted sub. PPP one two three one two three four four gifted a tier one sub to the Valky. It's true. A new subscriber arrives. It fills you with determination. It's probably fraud alerts. Could be. I should get emails from that though, and I didn't have emails from that yesterday. All right, so we need some swords some some cleavers and some people who can survive a hit or two. We want to get um, Xander with the reflecting and this guy with that one and probably this guy as well with the other one. We have one more, right? Somewhere there. And I don't want to bring Anyone else really? I'm annoyed about that. Okay. I don't care if it's wolves or not. I don't think it's guaranteed wolves, but it might be. Uh, I don't really want him to die. So we should probably play this with a more defensive setup. Do we have any more tier two shields? No, okay. Really, really annoyed about that. I think because it felt so avoidable. All right, you back up, get away from everybody. Why? Yeah. 
Dude, hard to see with these elevation changes too. It's a two though. So go there. We're down here. Probably better. I mean, it wasn't even a hard fight here, but fuck. Yes, we got a Brigham Marksman spawn on our archers, correct? Shit, I already swapped weapons too. Going for our guy. They're trying to they're trying to complete the mission though still. I'm so annoyed about losing that. Why is so, in my head I'm like that sucks? It's not even that big a deal. Who cares? It's really fucking annoying. You know what modifier was not removed though? Disappearing at the end of all that, disappearing villagers wasn't removed. Which means we still don't get to sell here. X potion is damage reflection. Okay, speaking of potions, we need to potion our fencer. Are we really building Patatol into a fencer with no initiative stars? It could be one of these thieves, right? But I can't even pay the iron tax because I can't fucking figure out why I can't pay with my card. I don't really want to like test it by randomly gifting subs to myself all the way, like all the way through the evening. try out these new builds don't really like that outcome of that oh well battle brothers about not enjoying outcomes sometimes yeah. non-assassin duelist no good all right well then if we believe in that we shouldn't i don't know i wanted to check the build out though so uh let's hide items again from nobu too much item manipulation anything else yeah that one anything else no we need to hit a taxidermist. There's one, I think, there. Nope. There. 
So we went over here too. Yeah. All right. We're going to go look for hunters. We're at 8K gold. We can't really sell. We can't handle zone, um, whatever they are right now. A new subscriber. Come steal yourself. We are Thank you, uh, Riven. Army. I don't want to fight honor guards particularly right now. No, no, no. Thanks. Okay. Wow, look at him path. I try to run around him and then click down, and he passed back to the road immediately. Didn't get our tools. All right, there's another oath taker with decent price and a bill hook. There's a hunter for 1600. Uh, taxidermist has bone plating, which we want. Trophy necklace, which takes our skins. Probably can build two of those if we don't want to craft our happy powder. We need one happy powder, though. I think I only have two skins, right? Yeah. Okay. Expensive crafting. We want another direwolf pelt. How many skins do we have? Three. I don't really want more of those. Okay. I, would, I was thinking I would level initiative, but maybe I only level it randomly. Okay. Like a point here or there kind of deal. I do eventually want more Alp potions. She leaves naturally, isn't that okay? It's okay to have her leave naturally when we have a replacement banner. It's not okay when she fucking leaves in the middle of, like, we're fighting orc warlords and she steals an item in between orc warlord camps, you know? So it's more about... And honestly, we could fix this character. This could actually be a very good banner with Kraken and like 5,000 veteran levels of fatigue. 10,000 maybe. All right, let's grab this hunter because we need hunters. Let's see if we got any decent stats on it. Where is it? There. 57 and one star. It's probably fine. 50 HP, 90. I mean, they low road all the things I care about, but it has a range star. Is that good enough? Probably. All right, can I get a name for the hunter, please, chat? Mods, rather. God, I'm so annoyed about that hex fight. Why? Why is... One more melee hunter? Yeah, maybe. Uh, Lou? Okay. All right, let's get our people in. Uh, you can have some fucking items. Isn't there a plus accuracy on both of my famed throwing weapons? Or are my other famed weapons? I'm looking at you, Nobu. No, not on that one. to break the Iron Man law. I think it is. I think that's the annoying part is, right? We have a system in place for if you get ridiculously rolled, what to do about it. We could look for a cultist banner. I'm really tempted by this 3,800 Oath Taker. But... I think we might just head south. What are the prices here? Can definitely make money off 225 wood if we get a thing for 16. All right, we can unload a little bit here. Cool. All right, bone figurines. These are just selling things, these splinters, right? It's the other ones that are good. Deformed valuables are just selling as well. Is there any world, world in which I need this many eyes? I guess I could look what the fuck they do. Elp Trophy, Night Owl Elixir, Potion of Knowledge, Snake Oil. Oh, 
I want any of these? All right. So many bows. Just have that many bows. selling here maybe god it's got me so tilted for some reason all right uh probably okay for gear otherwise we've got a little bit of gold again we should go down south and look at the next one one of these missions caravan five days no Tavern says Northwest, so no as well. Taxidermist says Dire Wolf, which we're not doing, okay. All right, let's go down to the other location that we can get them from is here, right? Wide Tull, okay. I don't wanna fight a bunch of dumb ass skeletons. No, no. If we had infinite time in our life, that's a fine fight to take. It's super easy, tons of experience, but it's really boring. Okay. No hunters. They've been raided. Disappearing villagers. Okay, so nothing of use here. Where do we want to go? South again, more arena fights. Another chance at an assassin. We need money. We could go back into Isengrab and do one more loop. Probably a lot of these have respawned. Tools are about stabilized, but not quite there. It's probably what we should do. Alright. There's tools. It's 90. Wait. I think we're just slightly under the cap, right? Some food there. No trade good for some reason. Nothing else of interest, really. At 133. I'll take 153 for this price. Okay. Head up this way. I think it's time to bust some camps again. Nobu, whose background is an anatomist, spots something gleaming a little ways off the main path. You walk over and take a look. There's something dark and metallic in the distance, perhaps a knight's corpse. Though it would make you wonder how he got there by himself. Nobu ponders aloud if perhaps something could be learned from the body of presumably great martial prowess. Knights rarely die alone, and they do. And if they do, they sure as shite don't keep their armor with them. It smells like a trap, though. I think we're going to it. Let's go get it. Against your better judgment, you go and take a look. You feel quite naked, walking across the open ground to the night, like a thief who steals by reaching all the way across the aisle. <laughs> what a great comparison. We can all relate. Nearing the corpse, you look back to ask the Zanabu frontline banner what his plans are for the dead body. You see the anatomist is standing stiff, his head back and his eyes open, a nervous and jittery hand pointing forward. You look back to see the corpse moving, slowly gathering itself off the ground, moaning and croaking. The helm juts forward as filth pours through its opening. You draw your sword. The black knight pushes itself off the ground, its gauntlets falling away to reveal pale flesh beneath. It turns to look at you and there's a slight hue of red glowing somewhere in that frothing helm. 
You slash the sword down and the creature's head falls free, clinking against the ground as air sputters out of its neck holes, sheathing your sword. You tell Xanabu that if he wants something to study, well, there it is. Also, be sure to carry its armor back to the wagon. Make sure you use your legs when you bend. You don't want to hurt your back or anything. You walk past the anatomist. He stares gobsmacked and closes his mouth and pulls out a quill and pen and some scrolls. His fear is put behind him and his usual self comes to the fore. A fresh specimen up close, recently deceased or perhaps recently redeceased. Either way, we have much to learn from this. You gain a decayed, closed, flat top and Nobu gets 200 experience. Weird. Okay. Pretty non-impactful event, but all right. How are we on ammunition? A little low. 167, it's probably fucking fine. All right, a lot of these haven't had time to respawn. Okay. 167 tools and we can't carry more tools, feels bad. 125, there's the trade goods we wanted. A bit more food available here. Let's grab the ammunition. Okay. All right, I should be repairing as we move. They have a bunch of people pop back up. They're pretty bad though, expensive militiamen and messengers. The negative modifier is gone, so we can buy trade goods here. All right, everything else is about as good as it's gonna get. Let's go into the Let's go find the Ezerok. I don't know if we can handle Ezerok right now, but let's go find it. Ah, oh, fuck, what, what time of day is it too? It's midday, it's about to be midday. We should use that potion if we're going to. I wanna try the fencer, so let's give him the po uh, fencing potions. Okay, what else do we pick up? The hex. So we still have all the potions that I want to use on a duelist when we get a decent duelist weapon. But that's the only ones right now? Oh no, that's the other one I want. Immune to being knocked or back or grabbed, I want on the tank. So where's that? Now I'm investing pretty heavily in a thief that hasn't rolled all that well. So I'm not sure that's great. But... Okay. Oh, the one HP and fatigue one. I forgot all about that. Um, no, not really. Okay. Where did we put that? It would be nice to get it out of my inventory, wouldn't it? You know who really needs it? It's fucking Nobu. All right, let's go east. How much acid we kicked this um, this morning? Well, learned about loading, the powers of the load. It's probably not a bad fight. It's pretty easy. It's right there. How many of our people healed? Just the fencer. We have a bone plating now. Do we have legendary armors? This is 183. Where's our better one? Right there. It's 202. Go. Fuck did it go there? Alright. I don't know if I want to waste our time on that or not. I can take some wounds. Does impact the sickness impact resolve? Yeah. And stamina. Our stamina is already so bad. We got people we want to level though, and it's a pretty easy fight. Although this is not one of them. 
And we kind of need some more recruits. can check my build sheets. I added potions to the build sheets for this playthrough to get a sense of where I'm planning to go with these. I can't be bothered to do this fight right now. I just can't. I don't want to fight zombies right now. Let's go east and find something more interesting. Check if these camps have changed at all. Could look for the Ezerok. Could also, while we're right here, take a quick look for another hunter respawning just in case. It's a thief called the Coward. It's probably not a good thief to roll on. So cheap, though. All right. He's weaseled and tough triple ranged attack. I thought that was triple ranged def uh, melee defense. Dude, he's got 65 HP, 160. Dude, his stats are great, except his stars are not good. Like, these stars, if that was his melee defense or melee attack, this would be amazing. As it is, I don't think this is playable, right? I have to roll well again. We just don't have any health. I mean, the 13 starting is really nice. So, uh, I think this max roll is 13 starting. It might be 16. Ah, it's tempting. What could I do with it, though? Like, nothing, right? Suddenly. We just bring him along because we need another guy. One of these guys is going to use that flail. Be a thrower if he leveled up? Not on 38. I mean, what does that even work out to be? Even if it's five every single time, which it is, right? 10 of those for 50 for 88. I mean. He's a cheap thrower. Do we want that? It's probably my f one of my favorite backgrounds. I don't care about resolve. I do care a lot about fatigue on archers. HP is nice too. Do we really believe we could level that? I mean, how's our what's our hunter? Our current hunter, sixty at one, so it's got ten more levels, nine more levels. at three, it's gonna be 87. This guy's gonna have five. Is it five or is it four and a half? It's four and a half, right? At three stars. So then it's 45 is 83. I don't think 83 is good enough. I think that's below my limit for that but the melee defense start the melee defense is good enough and the melee attacks good enough if he rolls well this turns out well this is probably just another roll well all right give me another name chat please or um, mods please i don't run fast adaptation on late game builds this makes me sad 83 not a good crossbow not really as a filthy robot oh no oh no Alright, let's try to get a group that I can walk around in without having to reset every two seconds here, too. Alright, we don't know what we're doing with this guy yet. It's good Stam is probably Flail. Alright, can we just run him as Flail for now? We can. Alright. Zero Stam or Nimble. Why is he frontline right now? No idea. Oh, the child. <laughs> Thanks. I got added and I read the at as that. Thanks. Okay. This guy probably wants to be replaced. So we're pretty light on brothers that we want to keep. Kinda. Okay. 
Care Bear is on the roll well train as well. So we have too many backline levelers as per always. Are we past the point where this guy can roll well? He kind of is, right? Even if he rolls well for the next three levels, it comes out at 82. He's very close to being dismissed, this guy, I think. Get rid of some of this garbage out of our inventory, including, I think I don't care about a 240, that's a 255, that's a 240, right, that one? 230, yeah, I don't give a shit about that. Ah, oh, it's such a pain in the ass having a drunk in the party. Alright, let's keep moving. A little light on supplies. Okay. And we're going orc hunting, I guess. Ways of getting ready tra traits, some some of them. Yep. All right, so let's say seven to ten warriors. That camp has changed. That camp is now terrifying. Maybe that was always that one, but we're going this way. Certainly don't want to fight 30 spiders in a forest. Can't imagine anything sounding more horrible than that. I mean, I don't know. It's a ton of experience. Spiders are pretty easy. Maybe. Do you want to fight 30 spiders in a forest? Unlikely. Is this a good spider killing weapon? Who knows? I feel like this is good. This is a good leveling fight for a lot of these guys. I don't know if we can run no banner or not. I gave you a potion, Nobu. You got one HP out of it. It's a great potion. I believe. I don't know why I believe, but I believe. Alright. Where did my spiders go? Spiders in swamp. They definitely have Pathfinder. I think I'd rather wait till they came out of the swamp. It's taking a lot of my day. Did I not bring arrows on the archer? All right, small mistakes. All right, should have maybe brought some arrows on the archer.
might just lose our new archer. Dude, he's breaking! It's one hit! Oh, remember when we didn't bring the banner? Because there's no reason to, because it's fucking spiders. The spider number has gone up, by the way. We were at 30, we're now at 40. He just broke. He just broke and there's no rallies for him. Maybe we just don't have the DPS for this fight? Are we really gonna fucking wipe twice today? Spider count back up to 40. A kind gesture. Thank you, uh, Arunch.
subscriber. Come, steal yourself. We are building an army. Yeah, reach weapon would be good. Don't have one though. Thank you, uh, Smoke Brandon. The sub. Oh, the five tier one subs, actually. Cheers. So we could kill one here. Don't we can? I hit one closer, maybe. All right, we reduced the spider count by three. That's good. I like how it didn't break, took two big body shots. Don't have the stam for another attack. Ouch. Didn't kill it because we don't have any fucking damage because we're netted and the two breaks didn't break. Feels bad. <sighs> These morale rolls are ridiculous. When you beat spiders, you kill them fast enough and you don't fucking panic your entire team by getting hit once. And you try to stay ahead of the web so that, uh... can do something. We're gonna die to this dot. We're already taking 10 damage worth of stuff. I actually think we lose here. So we can no longer get rid of web. It's so ridiculous.
Dude, they get morale from killing us too. They all went from breaking to full confident on this. Oh my god. What is today? I wonder if I got the, you know how scaling happens when you log out? I wonder if I got scaling. Yeah, it's definitely a wipe. Yeah, scaling. Well, we're dying to fucking spiders, which is impossible. Yes, we have one more iron tax banked, but man, it feels fucking bad to be wasting iron taxes on goddamn spiders. We're missing AoE here. Just can't kill him fast enough. No AoE swords, no AoE uh, axes, no AoE. Um, it's the last one that AoEs is decent. Fuck. So bad. <laughs> Alright, what do you think? We just end the stream here? Just pretend that Thursday never happened? I'll just be back Friday. Anything we can do differently? I mean, certainly we can do differently and we attack them. I could, for example, bring arrows on my archer or just not bring an archer. A gleaming endowment. Nice care bear. Always good to have reserves. I mean, we were taking this as a leveling fight. Do we try it again? Bring a rally so we don't fucking panic and have every have everyone be useless? Spider sure level, not wrong. Not wrong at all. I wonder if we sword spec this guy. Since he's gonna be fucking useless otherwise, right? Nimble Brothers, there. And he, where's the other ones? Take our corners again, I suppose. Is that enough killing power?
could shield at that edge, it's true. I have a lot of good shields left though, 26. I guess Tragic Rudy could do it. Fucking spiders. Imagine losing to them. Could equip some better helms, it's true. Alright, I think we're doing it again. Shield Cleaver Blow has a sh bro has a shield on the inside. Yeah, he needs it. He doesn't have any melee defense. It's Monic. 